Harry starts with a ball that goes through to the keeper. Oh, that's a good ball. That's the edge, Greg Brathwaite. Lucky to get it through the slip cordon. Didn't go to hand. I think he'll go all the way for four. It's a quick outfield. Put his leg out. Ooh, plays it a wide one, Craig Brathwaite. Got enough bat on it. Also got it in the gap, and he'll get a second boundary to that third man area. Oh, nicely on top of the ball, Tej Naran Chandra Paul. He's got a lot of bat on it. The ball's speeding away, and it will make the rope. So, first boundary for Chandra Paul this morning. This is Liam Scott. Oh. And that's a lovely shot down through mid on. I think that's going to race away. The outfield here is lightning fast, and he just timed that superbly there. Chips that away behind square. I don't think he's going to cut that off. No, he's not. Yeah, Liam Scott. Haskett. Well, he's flashed at that, and that has gone down to third man for four runs. It was a lovely sh Little holiday. Just get some bat on that, I think, and that's going very fine. We'll just watch the umpire here. Oh, beautiful shot. Full this time from Haskett, and this time Chandra Paul's got enough of it, and it will go for four. Lovely drive down the ground. Under lights, if you happen to... Uh... Oh, loose shot, big appeal, and I think I've gone up ahead, it has. And that's the end of Chandapal, the full delivery from Hope. A wick oh. this time in the air. Yeah. Yes, through yeah, the hands on for of four. And he's got that away back with a square. And that will run away to the boundary for four. This outfield will be quicker and quicker as the day goes on. And it drives that way. So he slashed at that. And it's gone flying over the top of the slips for four. I don't, Conway's probably going to have a little chat to him. He's gone all the way down there. It's a lovely shot. And that will go all the way for four runs. He's just driven that straight back past mid-on. who Mid-off, sorry. He had no chance. Some bounce for Harry Conway, but Craig Brathwaite nicely on top of it, pushes it into the covers. He gets back for a second run. And Kirk McKenzie slightly slow to get back for the second run. Nisbet just drags one down the leg side, flies past the diving wicket keeper. A shot this time, he is hit it in the air. Harry Conway has held on to it. <laughs> Took a tumble, but was well within the ropes. They'll come out world champions. Haskett in, top edge, pull shot, and oh, that's a pretty simple take for the wicketkeeper, Harry Matthias. It's a, not sure what sort of a four sweep shot from Brathwaite takes the top edge. Like everybody else at the moment, because we're sitting behind it. So Henry's just popping out. We're playing musical chairs here today because we've got the five commentators. So it's lovely drive that's got through the fielder. Don't know. We'll get to the boundary. That was. Oh, he's had a good swing at that. That short ball. He won't get a. Oh, bit of a misfield down there on the boundary, and he will get the four. Well, I join you with what is another boundary, so full this time and driven once again in that gap, and it will be four again. So, this is lovely batting from the West Indian number six. Warren Bull shot and is cut away for four again. This time it's Kawem Hodge who's punished him. Just a little bit of width. Oh, full ball, lovely shot. Bit of Caribbean flair about it. Gone all the way for four through the covers. Once again, stood tall. 
this bit gives Greaves some width and what we've learned about Justin Greaves already in this little innings is he'll just pounce on any width okay. foolish delivery lovely punch down the ground that will fly to the boundary for four just the direction of that new side screen just slightly to the right of it always quite amusing Oh, he's played that over the top of the slips, a short ball, and that will easily hit the boundary for four. A lovely shot, that, wasn't it? Short and wide, and well, just a one bounce four cut over backward point. Oh, it's gone through the slips. There's calls of, oh no, but it's away down to the third mound boundary for four. Cuts that, and that is a glorious stroke. That's probably one of the shots of the day. That's gone for four. Two wide by Haskett, and full toll taken of that by Hodge. That's a big shot, straight down the ground. Over the top he goes. Justin Greaves has grown in confidence as his innings has progressed, and picks up another boundary. Takes a quick single to mid on and brings up what will hopefully be well, what is his first half century of the tour. Conway to Greaves who clips it off his pads nicely wide mid on and well Jack Clayton's given up halfway to the boundary there as that rockets into the fence and Greaves continues on his merry way. Oh, and he's charged down the ground and lofted over the top. Has it gone all the way? It certainly has. And with that, Hodge also brings up his half century. Oh, and there is that dismissal. He's run right through him. We've been talking up his quicker one. I'm pretty sure that was definitely the arm ball. It was the arm ball. On the pads and lovely shot through mid-wicket. There's a lot to like about this Justin Greaves. He picks up another boundary. Oh, and he's played on. Wicket with the second new ball for the CA11 and Liam Haskett. Ooh. That should roll to the boundary. Screamer oh, of a catch! That is the most fantastic slips catch. He has dived full length to his right. Oh, it's in the air. Should be out. Well, that Soft. can only be described as agricultural. Oh, and he has got that through the slips. That was a pretty lucky shot for the batsman and unlucky for the bowler. That's gone for four. Well, he slashed at that. That's a lovely shot. Straight through the covers for four. Moti gets some healthy outside edge that flies past diving Hanscom. And it's funny, it is funny, isn't it? Because on the flip side, the CA11, if they can pick up a couple of wickets as that's worked on. If he's listening at home, oh. that's tickled around the corner for four more to the score, and that brings up the 250. No I doubt that it would have been a very unexpected phone call as that's played out to point to end the day.